Good evening. One person is dead and several others are injured after a shooting at the Choctaw Dell City High School football game at Choctaw High last night. Fox 25's Katie Rada joins us now with the latest. Katie, do police have any suspects in custody? Well, Grant, Choctaw police say they are still searching for the person or people responsible. In a press release sent out this afternoon, they say investigators have been given a description of a tall black male who is wearing red sweatpants as a person of interest. Officers say a 16 year old boy was shot in the groin area and died, adding he was not a student at either Choctaw or Dell City High School. Two others were also shot as gunfire erupted under the Friday night football lights around 1030 last night. What just happened? OK, guys, get down. Chaos broke out in the third quarter of the first high school football game of the season for Choctaw and Dell City. Students, athletes and people watching the game all running for their lives when they heard several gunshots coming from the visitor side of Bill Jensen Field at Choctaw High School. It was just a scary sight, you know, kids crying and you know, everybody crying. It's just, it was very traumatizing. Choctaw police believe an argument between at least two males led to the shooting. They say a 16 year old boy was shot and later died. He was not a student at either school. A 42 year old man was shot in the chest. He was transported to a local hospital where he underwent surgery and is now in the ICU recovering. They say one young girl was also shot in her thigh. She was treated and released. One uh, younger probably a high school student was treated and released. Police say two other girls believed to be students were injured trying to leave the area, sustaining broken wrists and a broken leg. According to police, two guns and eight rounds were recovered at the scene, but they are still investigating and searching for suspects. Reports have been that there have been two muzzle flashes and we have a huge amount of people to talk to. Uh, anybody that could have witnessed it, uh, you know, we have uh, students, we have band members things like that, that we need to um, get their names, uh, talk to them. Did they see anything? Police say there were several Choctaw and Dell City officers at the game when the shooting occurred. One Dell City officer discharged their service weapon during the incident. They were working the security for that side of the game. Uh, you got the two sides, so they were working the Dell City side. Exactly how or what, but they also, the officers will be interviewed and part of the investigation. Uh, we requested Oklahoma County to come out. Oklahoma County will handle my officer involved shooting. Choctaw Police, Dell City Police, and the Oklahoma County Sheriff's Office say they are all currently investigating and ask anyone with any information contact Oklahoma County Dispatch. In the Uvalde Foundation for Kids, a national nonprofit organization that formed following the Uvalde Texas school shooting, is offering a financial award for information that leads to the apprehension of a suspect. Choctaw Nakoma Park School District sent out a statement to students and parents today that says their top priority is to attend to and support the needs of their student population. Beginning on Monday, they will have counselors available for students, parents and staff, as well as additional police presence. To read the full release, go to our website, okcfox.com. Reporting live in studio, Katie Arata, Fox 25 News.